Hello there and welcome back to our video diary. Today I'm going to be talking about what type of towing vehicle we've got. Um, I've actually got a BMW 335X Drive Touring. Um, I brought it about a month ago now. Uh, we haven't actually took delivery of our caravan yet. It is due around June, um, the first week in June, so I'm quite looking forward to that. Um, the caravan we've brought is actually quite an heavy caravan. Um, it's a twin wheeler. It's a Swift and it's actually 1535 mass running weight. Um, we're told that our vehicle will tow 1700 kg, so it isn't quite the 80% match as what the guide actually gives you. So i um, just got to be careful of that the way we load the vehicle and um, load the caravan. So um, we should be okay um, as long as we don't overload the caravan. Uh, so just going to see how that works out. Um, today I'm just going to give you a bit of a walk around on our car. Um, to show the electric tail bar system that I'd put on it and how that works. I actually had um, a parking radar system put on the vehicle. It actually shows you um, the distance between the tail bar and the caravan. So obviously when you're reversing back to the caravan it gives you the distance and it's actually a bird's eye view actually back down on the tail bar. So quite looking forward to using that um, to see how that works. Um, I just like a bit of feedback really to somebody you know who's, who's got one of these cars or actually got on estates. As I, as I say on the road, there's a lot of four befores pull these vehicles on the quite big caravans, but I didn't see many estate pulling the twin wheeler, so I like a bit of review. And actually on our um, internet, there ain't much review on estate cars pulling you know twin wheeler caravans, um, especially on the BMW Touring. And um, there's quite I think the one in this country is the Passat. You know that's got a quite a good review in in Germany it's actually fourth in the tables of um, best car for touring caravan um, I know it's got quite a powerful engine but it ain't always about the power of the engine it's actually the weight of the vehicle to actually tow the caravan so I um, would like a bit more you know feedback off you guys to you know let me know if they've got if you've got one of these cars and then quite an heavy caravan um, so that's basically it really um, I'll give you a little walk around of the car in a minute. Um, so, see you in a little while then. Thank you. Bye. So here we are outside. Um, this is a BMW 335X Drive Touring. It's a mid-sized vehicle. Quite a nice looking car really. The black and white. It's a bit dirty at the moment. I haven't had a chance to watch it. <laughs> Just going to show you um, actually how the electric tail ball works. Now let's open the boot. As you see there, there's no tail ball showing. Invisible. The little um, cubby hole you pull down in here. Just pull that out. You can see it there. There's a button there. It's got a picture of the tail ball. Just press that. It starts flashing. And I'll come outside again. And you'll see the tail bar actually start to come down. Magic. It's great that is. So I didn't want a slightly tail bar showing on the back of the car. I think it does spoil vehicles with a big tail bar on the back. So there you have it. Nice and tight there. It takes about 30 seconds to drop. There's your electric up point there. A few electrics. Drop it all in there. And just to do the process again. Just press the button again. And it folds away. No problem at all, right? That's it. Just get away again, look. And what I'll do is for the purpose of this demonstration, I'll leave the tail ball out and show you the tail ball radar system. So just press the button again. As I've 
sure as it dropped out. That's it. Just drop the hoop down. What I'm going to do is just clean the camera because it's quite dirty. All the salt I've put on the road. You can see it there. Oh, I think you can see it there. There's a little camera there. Oh, I'll show you how the tailbar radar system works. Oh, it's a bit warmer in here as well. Um, so, what you do is just press the parking sensor button. We'll have a screen come up on there. Um, we'll have a set of menus to the left. Um, just scroll down to the camera where it says rear view camera. If I scroll that down now, there's a thing called tow bar system. Click onto that. And you'll see the tow ball there, look. And that's the actual radar system that is for towing or backing up to your caravan. So if I just put it in reverse, just show you going back. Just take it steady going back towards the garage. Yep. Take it steady. Now just imagine now if he's backing up to your caravan. It's just start to it by the garage doors now, look. So imagine if that was your caravan there, it's just going to give you the actual rain. I think it's a really brilliant system really, the way that works, so looking forward to using that. Pull it back down again. And that's it, that's the tailbar radar system. Really good. So I just come off that and close it all down. I hope this has been interesting to you. I haven't bored you too much. Um, please subscribe to my channel. Um, give me some of um, your advice and feedback regarding, you know, towing one of these vehicles if somebody's got one. And I'll speak to you in a little while then. See you later. Bye. Well, that's another um, end to another video. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Um, a little bit of review of the. Um, electric tailbar system and the um, tailbar radar system. Um, like a bit of feedback from yourselves, what you thought of this video. Um, I'm quite new to the YouTube malarkey, I'm a bit nervous. Um, Dan Trujan put me the idea of um, posting a few videos on here, just a bit of a review. We're just doing it for a bit of a laugh really, you know. Um, me and the missus have a bit of a laugh of the night um, when I'm putting some videos together. Um, I've done a bit of a um, bit of a Mickey take with this one now because um, Dan was on about um, they don't need to be like Spielberg, so I put a bit of an editing on the beginning of the um, the video clip, so that'll be quite funny to watch. Um, so um, I'm going to make this a, a weekly um, review of anything. If something comes up an idea, it's just going to be as we as and when we go away in our caravan, really. You know, I'll just let you know where we're stopping at and what's going on, what we think of our caravan. As I say, I mean, we're quite near back into the game. We had a caravan about, about 15, 16 years ago. That was a six berth, that was an Avondale Dart, so that's telling you how old the caravan was. You know, we used to enjoy that, so um, we've gone back down that route, um, having another caravan. Just gonna see how we get on with it, really. Um, so, take care, and I'll speak to you soon. See you later, bye.
Remember when everything you did was for the sheer pleasure of doing it. BMW X-Drive. Intelligent all-wheel drive.